this is the setup for our for the project we've used a bluetooth module uh, connected to the arduino board this is the heart rate variability sensor it records the ecg signal and gives the heart rate variability as the output uh, the electrodes are placed on the body and uh, this is the code that's uh, uploaded on the board this is the drowsiness index calculated if you can see it follows a constant trend and doesn't uh, the time series structure doesn't decrease with time that is because the subject is uh, in an alert state and not falling asleep this is the heart rate variability signal the hrv signal versus time FFT technique is applied on uh, the time domain signal to obtain the low frequency and the high frequency components from the power spectral density of the signal. The drowsiness index is calculated as LF by HF. This can be seen showing the code here. So the drowsiness index is calculated like this. We are now trying to uh, send the Bluetooth alert message uh, uh, to simulate drowsiness behavior. Uh, we are forcing the drowsiness index to be uh, equal to 0 0.05. Uh, and the threshold is already chosen to be equal to 0.1 so the drowsiness index is now falling below the threshold so the bluetooth uh, uh, messages will be sent to the mobile app now so uh, uh, we are going to pair with hc05 uh, HC05 is the Bluetooth module that is being used. Uh, when we pair with it and use it as a terminal, um, we're going to get uh, uh, receive. We're going to receive the alert message on the mobile phone. Like this.